Good morning. It's Monday morning. President Biden, President Obama asked for an investigation in 2008. It's about your prison industry. Shorty, pull your mask up? No. Shorty on mask in Baltimore. See where I'm at? Central booking. I go to jail for the right reasons. Call the police. Like I said, it's my Martin Luther King Malcolm X moment. Now I'm going to give you Thurgood Marshall. On February the 2nd, 2011, my mother died from cancer. I blew the whistle on Scott Schellenberger, Greg Bernstein, and Governor O'Malley's mind machine, the money you make off the prison industry. Today's my judgment day. We have an art in the park on the 17th. This is a prelude. All this is evidence for a federal investigation. President Biden got my information. Secret Service investigated me. Department of Justice got a case file. So did the FBI. The same way that you did Martin, the same way that you did Malcolm, I did you. I flipped it. I gave you all my information. You ain't got to watch me. I was watching you. Can you hear me now? My trick! I'm a copywritten criminal. You feel me? I'm a copywritten criminal. On February the 2nd, 2011, I blew the whistle on y'all. Illinois and Maryland, and these are the cases. Mayor Pugh know about it, and there was evidence, all right, about an interstate compact, about the money you make off the prison industry. My interstate compact said Maryland, Illinois, and Las Vegas, Nevada. I was headed to Las Vegas, Nevada. I had property out there. Brandon Scott know all about this. He was a councilman. That's the chief pro chief Hyatt and the state prosecutor because I filed kidnapping charges against Scott Schellenberger and you ain't did nothing. You protecting white supremacy with your offices. Racism 2021. Do blacks have rights in which white America respects? Racism don't work without black cooperation. I use the toilet to do what I do because the toilet don't care if you're black, white, straight, or gay. A toilet take your shit every day. See that? Eric Holder, Rod Rosenstein, Alan Locks, Greg Bernstein, Doug Gansler, State Prosecutor, Mosby. You see that? I blew the whistle on your prison industry and the money you make off black bodies. The money you make off black bodies. That's Brian Frosch. That's Eric Holder. That's Johnny Oleski. That's my son. I got a vested interest in this. These is my sisters and brothers and we signed off on this. That's mail fraud and theft, vandalism complaint. And that's my complaint number, Department of Justice. You see that? These are the supporters of Shorties. And welcome to the big show. Welcome to the big show. <laughs> that's Dwayne Davis. And that's the IRS, because I need a federal and state audit. I work with Out for Justice. I work with the Job Opportunity Task Force. That's me, 1402 Lochner. Dear Mr. Humphreys, that's 2009. Dear Mr. Humphreys, this is my third letter to your office in the state of Maryland requesting a public hearing concerning my illegal incarceration. That's me. And that's me. And that's the U.S. Attorney's Office. 2019, and you ain't did nothing yet. That's me. 2009. 2009. See the people? The Maryland Black Caucus. I put that toilet out because I was exposing your prison industry. Social media for social change. You feel me? I was exposing your prison industry. This is Shorty's Underground, like Harriet Tubman's Underground, Shorty's Underground, Real Shack and Catering. I'm copywritten. I own all parts of me. I'm the chairman, the president, the treasurer, and the secretary. You feel me? And that's since 1998. That's 2006, Falls Road, get shorty. And that toilet was in front of City Hall for a long time. That's the same toilet you locked me up for. And that's the same toilet right there. Like I said, your prison industry. We traded the penitentiary for the plant. We traded the penitentiary for the plantation, cotton for cocaine and we the cash crop. I was making a movie about it. That's Michael Bush. That's the Maryland Black Caucus. That's Tony Bridges. That's Branch. That's WJZ. That's Bobby Zirkin. I named the judges and the lawyers that participated in this. And that's Governor O'Malley. Right there. We're talking about stopping frisk and zero tolerance and the money you make off black bodies. 
I gave you a ceasefire program and I took it to the Capitol. All right, my sons, you feel me? My sons and my daughters. That's Vital Magazine, Accountability. That's Shorty's Pit Beef. That's Peter Francott and the controller. Because like I said, I asked for an audit. I've been asking for an audit for the longest. I was insured when I did this with Brother Insurance. I was insured against terrorism. That toilet been to Chicago, New York, Philadelphia. And it's all about your prison industry. Spring Grove Medical Facility. All right? Shorty. It's about the property you took from me. 07CF4988. All right? It's about the false charges that you filed against me. So we're going to the Supreme Court with this. The grand jury of the Supreme Court. And these are rules of the Supreme Court. And we're going to take these emails to the Supreme Court, the Chicago FBI, the Baltimore FBI. You see that? We're going to take this to the Supreme Court, GOP Carter. We're going to end corruption, GOP Carter. Yeah. We're going to take all this because you're a part of this. That's Senate Bill 374, accessing the grand jury. We're going to access the grand jury in 2021 or we're going to the Supreme Court. Grand jury, Supreme Court, about your prison industry. Like I said, this is a public display. I'm not Emmett Till. I'm not George Floyd. I'm not Tyrone West. I don't stutter when I talk. And I don't want to be one of these stars on the walk. I told you I was making a movie about y'all. That's Kelly, 2007. Shorty's Pit Beef and Ribs. Per your request to get a sandwich 10 days ago. Your submission for the deadline is passed this year. That was for 2009. That's received 2008. P.O. Box 38. In regards to your documentary, I will not be able to appear. That's Senator Cardins. That's Blagojevich. He told me to talk to Blagojevich. If Blagojevich can go to jail, y'all can go to jail. Like I said, that's me. Judge Waller, Judge Boris. You see that? See the names on here? Pastor the Caples. Right here, false imprisonment for making a documentary. Judge Starks, Judge Rossetti, Judge Boris, Angelo Kyle, Audrey Nixon, Robert Sabandon, Sheriff Coran. That's the case. That's my grandfather. He taught me about race and racism. That's my grandfather. He was born in 1901. That's President Obama in 2000, what? And that's Judge Mary Barbara. Told y'all I was making a movie about y'all. And it's about Airmark, your prison industry and the money you make off of black bodies. Airmark. 2008. Dear Mr. Davis, thank you for your request. That's President Obama. That's President Obama. That's Airmark. This is to prove I was making a movie about you so you can't sue me. Yeah, I was making a movie about you and your prison industry. Right here. And your police department. See the dates? 2009. It's the art of getting money. And I just made y'all what you is. The haves versus the have-nots. Judge Bell, Sharon Sneed, Nick Mosby, Marilyn Mosby. Yeah. Layola Blakefield, graduates. This is about Governor Hogan. Yeah, Governor Hogan and Ronald Reagan, the war on drugs. And I'm sending this to Amnesty International. Yeah, I'm sending this to Amnesty International. Shorty, pull your mask up? No, we're going to unmask Baltimore. This is part two. It's about your prison industry and making a movie about you. That's Frederick Douglass, that's Thurgood Marshall. These are other members. This is the NAACP. And this is Stanley Hoyer and your constitution. And this is part three. Shorty, pull your mask up. Yeah, I'm gonna unmask Baltimore. Yeah, harassment, false imprisonment, false arrest for a toilet. Yeah, for a toilet. Cause I gave you the shorty program. I gave you the shorty program right here. 
social, economic, political, medical, environmental. I gave it to you. And that's the case. That's Governor Hogan. That's me, Mayor Pugh and Boyd. And this is the case right here. Governor O'Malley, Connie Johnson, Bernstein, Schellenberger. See this? I was making a movie and I'm at the finish line. The Shorty Program. I'm the founding member of the Baltimore Block. And this is for leaders of a beautiful struggle. Y'all trying to steal our slogan from the streets to the seats. That's how it go. That's my first dollar I made. And these are the people I made that money with. That's Kathleen Hughes. TV One, Radio One. That's Ray Lewis. And that's the Ravens. I did this in the memory of Martin Luther King because he died yesterday. He was murdered on April the 4th. And nobody said nothing about him. So I'm hailing his name up. April the 4th. That's the Ravens. Never say die. That's the shorty program. So Mayor Brandon Scott, Ryan Dorsey, Baltimore City Council, President Biden, Department of Justice, FBI, I was kidnapped because I was making a movie about your prison industry and the war on drugs. Here's my evidence. And I go to jail for the right reasons. My check! No justice, no peace.